Hi guys, Duffin here. So I'm pay playing some Payday 2, you know, the new DLC for PlayStation 4. Now this is a DLC that me and many others never thought we would actually get on the console versions. And I'm actually playing as Jacket on this map here. You know, we got free DLC and from the DLC we got, you know, Jacket as a playable character in the game, you know. The, uh, Payday 2 and Hotline Miami are actually like related games, so there is DLC for each game, sort of, from the other. And another uh, related game, you know, to Hotline Miami that I haven't talked about, but I've shown you before, is Shadow Warrior. And in Shadow Warrior you have like the katana from Hotline Miami, you have arcade cabinets from the game as well. So, yeah, it's cool to have these like... Uh, 3D games with, you know, Hotline Miami stuff in them. And, you know, so right here I'm playing the Golden Green Casino DLC. Now, I think this map is fantastic. It's the perfect setting for Hotline Miami characters and masks. So yeah, as you can see, I'm, I'm playing with, you know, as Yakit. And I'm having the, you know, the Rooster Mask, the Richard Mask. Yeah. So, there are many uh, new masks actually in Payday 2 that we didn't have before, you know, Hotline Miami masks. Uh, these masks, I've, I've shown you in a video, but I can tell you some of the masks, like, we do have uh, Jake mask now, we do have Alex mask, Corey, uh, Tony's Revenge, Richter, Biker, and I believe some more, actually. So yeah. It is awesome. So yeah, I, I really like this map so far and yeah. I think that, you know, the weapons as well. We do have Hotline Miami weapons. I do have like the butcher knife, you know, that a biker has in the Hotline Miami games. I do have that as my me melee weapon here. You also have like submachine guns in the inventory, you know, so you can buy from Hotline Miami. And usually, you know, in Payday 2. So yeah, really, really good map and, you know, DLC. It's perfect, you know, because, you know, Hotline Miami is a 2D game, right? But here you get to see, like, 3D environments and still be playing as Jacket, you know, with these different masks and stuff. I, I would love it if they would put in, like, other Hotline Miami characters as well, you know. We should sort of have all the masks we need right now. Every fan favorite is there, sort of. So... What we should do, what we should get for uh, Payday 2 is probably like more characters, you know, Biker would be awesome, Richter, you know, that would be really, really nice to have other characters as well. Now, will we get more DLC in the future for Payday 2, you know? Uh, hopefully, I mean, perhaps this is the final DLC because we have, we have had a lot of DLC, man, for Payday 2. Perhaps they sh are going to make the next game, you know. Perhaps that's why they uh, release this now, because they're finished with the DLC. I'm not really sure, I'm just speculating on that one. So, yeah. We will have to see in the future, I guess. And, you know, Shadow Warrior 2, uh, you know, Shadow Warrior 1 was, like, related to Hotline Miami. So, Shadow Warrior 2 is actually right around the corner. It's coming out this fall, I believe. So... Yeah, you have to look forward to, like, Shadow Warrior 2. We will see what they put in the game. Perhaps there is, a, like, a Hotline Miami 2 arcade cabinet. You know, it was a Hotline Miami 1 arcade cabinet in the first one. So perhaps they will put the second one in there, just for fun, you know. That would be really nice, actually. And if they put in, like, you know, other Hotline Miami weapons and stuff, and perhaps even characters this time, that would be awesome. Or if they even... The coolest thing would be if they like remade a Hotline Miami level, but you could play it in 3D. That would be really, really nice. So yeah, that's what I'm looking forward with these Hotline Miami related uh, games, you know. So yeah, guys, have a good one.